Hey everybody, welcome back to Northern Lion Plays the Bunny. It's not the Bunny of Isaac, it's Darkest Dungeon. Okay, so Wolves at the Door. Google is your friend here, okay? It's a unique mission triggered by the town event Brigand Incursion. It tasks the player with stopping a group of brigands. It's a rare town event. It will not occur before week 40. You must have at least four level 5 heroes. Base chance is about 12%. It will not appear again for at least four weeks. It is a static map. The missions will always be the same. Bring all the shovels available. What on earth? <laughs> oh, you lose upgrades if you don't do it. Okay. An easy way to bypass the event is to send a team of useless recruits fresh off the stage coast, stagecoach into the quest and immediately abandon it. Doing this allows you to avoid the potential loss of a high-level hero and keep your building upgrades. If you only send in a single hero and retreat, that hero will not die. In combat. Oh my lord. I kind of want to try it. I'm just looking at the, the enemies that we got here. I'm basically cheating by looking up the tactic in advance, okay? Let me see. There's seven rooms. When you begin, you're given the choice to go up left or up right. Either room you pick, you'll get a chance of going to the side or continuing up. If you go up, you'll find Vavolf. Well, the left path leads to treasure. There's a treasure room in the center as well. It's very likely to find ancestral trinkets in said treasure locations, which makes the errand worth it. Ah, but we could go back for the treasure after slash if we defeat him. Okay, so it seems like if we're going to go on the mission, um, the recommended party composition includes a man-at-arms. So, non-negotiably, Robert... Is going to be on the mission in some sort of capacity. So he's going to need to be upgraded. Um, it also recommends an occultist. And luckily we got somebody who fits the bill. If we're going to roll an occultist. I think we would. it would also be advantageous for us to roll um, perhaps a gravekeeper. Who actually operates best in this position. Uh, and then ideally an arbalist. But do you, you don't, you're, not, you're okay with position one. So you use, um, perhaps Defender. So we're going to need to spend on this one. Yeah, we're going to need to spend quite a lot, I think. And then the other one would be an Arbalist. So you'd roll like an Arbalist here and you'd swap these two people. Can you operate here? We're not using Weakening Curse, unfortunately, but the mark is still good. And then you, when you move, if you lunge, you're going to go hip. You're still going to be good. You're still, yeah, okay, Nick's going to be fine. I think this will work, but it, well, it'll be an attempt at least. But it's going to be a, it's going to be a bit of a, a spendy situation. So I'm going to start by going to the Nomad Wagon. And uh, we're just going to unequip, sort by rarity. And we're going to sell all of our duplicates that we never use more than one of. We probably should sell everything that we never use. Like, our common level trinkets are probably next to useless. Well, let's be logical. Are we ever going to use the stun stone? No. Are we ever going to use the move stone? No. Are we ever going to use the move charm? No. Not for minus one speed. Health stone. Hey, listen, if we were going to use these, we would have used them by now, is what I'm going to say about that. The dodge stone is probably like a theoretical option, but the thing is, we have so many good trinkets, we're almost exclusively going to use. Like, a red trinket and a blue trinket on most units. Like, I know we're never going to use a Blight Stone. Plus 15% Blight Chance? What do we care? We don't even look this low on the trinket list anymore. I might keep... Some, like, class exclusive ones, but not many. So that's an extra 10k gold that, if I'm being honest, we're... I mean, this is decent, but... I think... But we sold some stuff we're probably never going to even notice we're missing. Slippery boots, I think, are okay. Never with the... Never move at the expense of speed. Let's put it that way. So that probably pays for the upgrades that we need. Um, so right off the bat, we know, like... Oh, my God. It's so expensive. <laughs> this is ridiculous, dude. So just to get Nick to that level is going to be like, it's going to be pricey, let's be honest. 
you know what? I'm willing to go a little deeper. Okay, let's be smart. We ever gonna... maybe? Unlikely. Never. 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 It's possible. It's possible. Alright, well... That didn't really give us that much more money. as deep as I'm willing to go though so let's let's start what do, what do you need on Robert here let's see man at arms defender allowing him to tank the bombs for your entire team while taking only single digit damage defender okay so I mean step one you're gonna take Robert in here well you know you need to upgrade his armor at the very least but probably both is fair um, hey we just got an achievement probably for having one fully upgraded unit and then, like, on the guild, surely. We need to get Defender. And upgrade it. Alright, that's highly expensive. Then, who's next most important? I would say probably... Uh, Wolf's already upgraded there, but... Um, Wolf needs at least that. That's fine. I would say probably Nicholas... If we lose one of these guys, I'm going to be real cheese, dude. Then you got to think, like... Oh, it's pricey. That, it hurts. It, that's expensive. But, then, you know, four fully upgraded heroes for what we did on the last mission is maybe okay. Um, they also want us to take a lot of shovels, so we might want to cool it a little bit. You don't need the extra pull. You're, you're fully kitted. You're set. Oh, I mean, okay. <laughs> Is this how we're gonna do it? We know that you need Defender. What do you not use? Usually the stun at this point. Plus 26% protection is really good. Alright. Um, well, we're gonna try. Because you know what? That's the spirit of, uh, of, of play. So we know Nick likes the Sniper's Ring. And actually giving him the damage is not super foolish. You don't do extra damage against marked units, do you? I'm thinking of the Bounty Hunter, but the Bounty Hunter is far too low uh, on level here, but still. I actually think Nick gets the damage. I'll give you speed. Like, your speed is going to be... Ah, well, you got two different animal parts there. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Um, you probably want tough ring. You know what? No, 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 no. Okay. Nick doesn't get the sniper's ring. No, Nick doesn't get the damage. He gets the extra crit chance. Because he does better against marked units. You... Forget the tail feather. You get the extra damage. You obviously get the heal. And, uh... I don't know if that's even worth it on you, to be honest. You don't really care about your speed. Robert could do with the speed. And you know what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's let's he's just going to tank like crazy. And then the occultist gets something else. Sunring. It's ack. Stun chance, debuff chance. I guess we'll go for the debuff because we are going to be using the mark, if not the uh, weakening curse. By ignoring... Oh! Cancel embark. My mistake. I went to the wrong mission. There we go. Now, it said take as many shovels as you can. I don't, I'm assuming we also take other stuff. Hamlet, short. I don't know, dude. Uh, let's take 12, uh, 16 food. That's probably way too much. Eight torches. I don't know. Um, take four holy waters because I don't know what I'm getting myself into. One skeleton key. I don't know. I actually have no idea. And just make sure you're good. You can operate. You can definitely operate. You just can't use abyssal. Who cares? Are you ever... No, because you're only going to get moved back one. You might want to remove Abyssal and replace it. I mean, even with, like, 
It's low, but even a st uh, stun is something. No, you can't use it in the third spot. Okay, so demons pull. Um, you're pretty much kitted. Oh, you do do extra damage against marked units. And Nick's good to go. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Well, here we go, boys. Might lose all of our party members. We got to save our Hamlet. We've invested so many portraits and deeds and etc. and etc. I love these uh, unique events, too. So you have the choice to go up left or up right. And then if you go up second time... Oh! <laughs> I'm nervous. If you go up a second time, you get uh, you get to fight the boss. We, we're not camping. Absolutely not. No big deal. All right. How do you handle this? 12, 17, 12. 6 to 11 damage. I hate this music, dude. It's freaking me. Crit chance, 25. Go for the bolus attempt, that's my opinion. 8 to 16. Go for the kill. Oh, you are an idiot! Why are you so bad? 6 5. Good, good, good. He health is okay. Very slow start. I mean, it's the darkest level mission. It's the first one we've ever been on. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Guard the occultist. I'm ready. Hit Robert with your best freaking shot. We probably do want to get some retributions going at some point. All right, there we go. Some real attacks. Very happy to see it. Our whole squad is kitted. Go ahead. Hit him. We got to get some heals out here. Good start. Very good start. Two HP on yourself. Really appreciate it. Okay. Less good. I like how Rob's head looks like it comes off during that. Um, straight up. Ah, we gotta at least kill one of these units. Nicholas. You guys are you're tilting me a little bit, I'm just gonna say. Press this advantage. Go ahead and hit me. I'm ready. There we go, a real heal. <coughs> Pardon me. Alright, if we just heal, he's gonna probably ruin his own life. Um, I don't want to kill him, if possible. We want to stall a little bit. If we can get out just a couple more heals, I'll be a very happy man. This fight probably should not have been this difficult, but we did get a couple of, like, just barely under kills. Again, I don't really care what he does, so... Let's take care of the corpses for now. I may regret this. We'll see. Can we not... We probably can't guard multiple units simultaneously, huh? You really... You know what, Fox Mulder? I can't complain. Get those low rolls out of the way early. Thanks for critting the Arbalist. I really appreciate it. That's alright. Heal yourself. You gotta clean your own mirror, Dan Giesling. Everybody. If we can just inch ourselves slightly closer. I just wanna see if this takes off the. It does take off the guard, okay. You know what? You did that to yourself. You had your chance. Pardon my reach. Good line. You know what? I respect a good line. We shouldn't worry too much about HP, I suppose, because uh, we do have a lot of food and no ability to camp. A lot might be a stretch. We have a little food. Traveler's tent. We don't know, but let's check. Wow. Um, that's a lot. That's a lot of gold. Pays for one person's upgrades. So I'm assuming battle. In Radiance, may we find victory. I'm assuming non-stop battles. The madman's gotta go. We do not have stress heals of any sort. 16 stress is not great, obviously. 
Jesus. Critting for eight on a stealth blanket fire is highly annoying. No diseases, please. All right. Do we get it? Finally, we get a chance to do something. Um, I'm worried about this guy right here. Now, you're not going to kill anybody. But could you make it so this guy gets killed? Yes. You give Nicholas a great chance to finish the job here. I think you definitely want to, you know, maybe guard the healer just on turn one here. Then mark yourself next turn. Now, you, I know you're getting stressed out. That's okay. 11 to 21 damage. You make it very tempting to not go for you. But what's, I mean, Nicholas's damage might not be that good to begin with. So, yeah, okay, good choice, good choice. This guy's got 36 dodge. Keep that in mind. I can live with that. Shank. Five damage. Big whoop. No big deal. Oh, dude, thanks. I appreciate the mark, honestly. All right, now. Throwing dagger. He's going to take a couple more hits to take out. You know we got a blank of fire coming up. Great dodge. Go ahead. Oh, no. It's five damage. No disease. Not a great bleed, admittedly. I think we really need to heal you. And that Dude, 30 HP goes a long way on Robert. I will use a bandage. And then, you know, I'm tempted to just crush this fool, but I don't think it's the right call. I think we want to use Retribution. Doesn't matter as long as we get the repost. Doesn't matter much. Beauty. Gotta love it. Uh, sniper shot? He's torched. All right. Now, the Blanket Fire Boy at the back is very annoying, admittedly. Let's see if we can heal ourselves up as much as possible. Always put your own oxygen mask on before your uh, seatmates. Great start. Um... I mean, crush again. It's something, but you'd probably rather just keep buffing your protection. Sorry, right. just I know that's not your it's not your ideal position to be in is to just uh, be throwing daggers at people. But you know your lunge is there for like a final shot, basically. Oh, that hurts. Not that much, but it hurts enough to, to make me a little upset. Good crit. Good crit, Nicholas. That's a retribution crit. HP's looking fine. Stress could obviously be better. I'd like to stall for a turn. A brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. Still stalling. Go ahead. Never gonna hit. <laughs> That's fine. I mean, it's not good, but it's fine. Might as well double up on the bleed before we use a bandage. Straight up. Heal yourself. I'm not even worried. That is still six damage there, though. Ooh, now that annoys me. But you know what? If you can take an extra turn, why not? All right, in the end, I like it. I am a little annoyed uh, by our stress, but life goes on. Don't have enough room for this. You know what? Forget it. We got more than enough loot coming later. So scouting, um, the boss should be directly above us. Like right here, right? Everybody back to default positions, please. Thank you. All right, so we're going to give it a try. Um, I expect there's a fairly... Go ahead. There's a fairly realistic chance we'll lose perhaps all of our units. I'm, I'm prepared for that, even though I'd rather uh, obviously not. The match is but I'm ready to give it a shot, at least. Okay, well, we're not quite there yet. <laughs> Probably front unit is where you gotta start here. Stress is becoming a real issue. We did not take a stress unit, so what do you expect? You know what, let's start with Retribution. See if we can incentivize these units to target us instead. Then we'll start guarding. We can't hit him with a sniper shot, but a, a throwing dagger or a lunge could put him in an awkward spot. Oh, we can't hit him with the... Well... I think in terms of the economy of movement, that was probably relatively smart. Blind fire does 10% less damage, but gives you 4 speed, so... Oh! <laughs> 
That's really smart. Well, it's really good. I don't know if I'd use the word smart. Hey, you're supposed to hit, um... You're supposed to hit the... This guy right here. You made a terrible mistake. Now, Shadow Fade exists, but... Dude, Wolf is in it to win it. He's finally out of the doldrums of doing one less than the enemy's current HP. What do we do next? Honestly, we could take some turns to heal. Just leave our HP in a decent spot. It's either that or Bolus, this fool, which is not worth a whole heck of a lot. I mean, the HP... HP is fine right now. Especially knowing, like, food exists. What do we care? I just want to kill this guy as soon as possible. That's not going to do it. This will do it. All right. So, presumably, our next fight is going to be the, the boss or the pseudo-boss, whatever you'd like Success. to call him. So clearly, Let's get yourself up to the door. Or is it merely and be ready for, for anything. Daddy does not shy away from a little... Sandpaper. Okay, there he is. Hello. He's at the front. Bombs away. I'm gonna just say that that was probably extremely... He's done it? Now. You can't throw a dagger at him. Oh, you might be able to destroy his bombs pretty easily, though. Oh, it hurts you when you hit them, I see. Get them! Oh, no. I was gonna... You know we spawn in units. It's just guaranteed. Honestly, put some marks on the big boy. He's in a perfect position to get shot by the Arbalist from the start of this. By the way, take some holy water just in case. 44 crit chance. Tower shield. Oh, yeah. Okay, guard the unit I wasn't even shooting at anyway. Fine by me. 26 damage to Rob is obviously bad. But for two moves, we basically protect him. Please stop this. Clutch dodge. We actually, it, I wouldn't say that things look amazing right now. I think they're a little spooky, but. Now, how many turns? You got two more turns of marked. Warcry, no debuffs, please. If it's stress, I can live with it for now. You have to heal Robert. Healing him for seven is not very good. Probably should have had him. Oh, you can't munch on some food anyway. How many turns do you get? Crits, please. He's no longer marked. Dang. Time's up. 10 damage. Not so bad. Bombs away. Dude! <laughs> I guess we'll just put him in retribution mode. Um... Okay, you still... I mean, you need the mark, but you also need the heal. How much HP does he have? Max HP 64. There's got... Can I just... Don't... I don't want to do the move yet. Because I... <sighs> I'm sorry, Rob. But really, it's a compliment. I'm, I'm saying that I think you've got everything under control. Lunge is only 27 damage. It's not a good time to pop it yet, especially because we'll get killed in the explosion. Just keep throwing those in. 21 is the high end of a non-crit roll. Slice me. Fine by me. Wasted in action. Yeah, keep guarding the unit I do not care about. I really appreciate it. We're going for Big Daddy. 39% crit chance. That's all right. 39 is not 100. Just, Rob, can you cool it a little bit? Two damage is not that much. Time's up. 17 is enough to be a little sore over, but who's getting in next? All right. Just keep... Robert, you're doing great work right now. You are actually like a... You're a hero. The hero of the likes of which we've never seen before. Um... 21% chance of a crit. This gives Nick a really good chance to finish the job, I think. So, I think that's your your optimum time. We are going to do the same thing we've always done. Throw a little guard up. Now, obviously, 
a heal would be of the utmost value. No stuns. Oh, that's real bad. Um, if we kill him, do you think his bomb still goes off? I bet it does. A little spooky. Could have gone for an attack. Could have gone for... Well, he could have gone for a, another mark because he's about to purge it, but... 18 damage. Oh, I got a crit to make it happen. Oh! Nicholas! The hero! With the clutchest crit I've ever seen in my life. Seize this momentum. Push on to okay. the tasks. Okay, what do we do? Well, eat a buttload of food. Take some bandages. And then, uh... Two, three, four. You, obviously you want that. That's like... Should be extremely clear. Um... We probably want to go back for a little bit of treasure is what I'm thinking. And I think it's very clear we do not need anti-venom. Mind you, we don't care about the bleed stone either. You're full? You're full? Okay, just keep the food for now. Um, we might as well take the bleed stone for now, but no. Continue adventuring just temporarily. Um, I don't want to be greedy with it, but the treasure is to the left of this room. I'm assuming we got combat. It would be the worst thing in the world to take damage. I, and here's the thing. I assume that Robert's stress is going to rise to the point that he's probably going to become afflicted. I'm okay with that if the treasure ends up being worth it. But, dude, as of right now, the strategy from the wiki, who would have thought it turned out to work beautifully? Robert's ability to just guard whatever unit is destined to be hit. He would have been a perfect choice to take on the Fulminating Prophet mission. Little did I know. All right, hello. No more stress, please. No more stress, please. No more stress, please. No more stress. Okay, here comes the afflictions. I still think we're in the clear if we get money out of it. Right, he's a stalwart. He can't be stopped. He's a god. Many fall in the face of chaos, but not this one. Many fall in the face of chaos, but not this one. Um, get reconstructed, Robert. We can rebuild him. We can make him better. No diseases. Alright, here we go. Um, right off the bat. Here comes some retribution. Mark me. He beat me! Straight up! Pay him! Pay that man his rear post. Nicholas, this one's on you, buddy. You already got one... Mission critical... Critical hit. Boom. That's the sound of my bow shooting all the strand stealers in the game. Crushed? Nah, nah. Won't be necessary. Get behind Robert. You can't hit anything. Alright, you can hit him. That's fine, though. So, Bolus gets the kill here. We really ought to either, like, lunge for a pretty easy kill. You haven't attacked yet, so I'm going to take you out. Dude, don't let, don't be sleeping on Wolf's contributions as well. He has some serious attacks. Whittled uh, the situation. Very good combination of moves here. And don't forget about Fox Mulder, dude. Stepping up in the clutch, using those marks and heals appropriately. I do want to take the heirlooms, so I think I'm going to dump the torches. This has been probably, I mean, it's a darkest level mission. We only fought about three enemies total, but let's see how this goes. More stress. It's actually not that bad now that Robert got the virtue. Alright, so obviously you got to go first, but how are we going to make that happen? Uh, with a heal? <laughs> actually, you know what? Oh, okay, well, the heal would have been a nice call, I guess. Good, good, great work. Nicholas, that's a good roll, buddy. You can't hurt Robert. Like, I don't know why you even target him. It's just a waste of your time. Get that repost ready. I finally am starting to understand the marksman, perhaps, a little bit. Wolf in the clutch. You can find him in the clutch. Bottle full of bub. My mind got what you need. You get the idea. Anyway, this guy's toast. Get behind me. Do 
12 damage is not too bad too bad here. This guy might live for a turn now that I think about it, but. Oh! <laughs> Alright, you can hit me, it turns out, but not for much, okay? And I don't care about HP. I care about stress. Go ahead. It, it's, all, it's worse for you, buddy. We are going to need the stress heal at least uh, two of these units, it looks like. But big whoop. Honestly, I, I kind of don't want to go for the crush. But the reason is because it puts this guy out of... Oh, no, if there's a corpse, it doesn't put him out of sniper shot range. Not that it matters, because, like, yeah, exactly. Beauty work. Bring, bing, bing, bing. We probably don't want this trinket, but it is sellable, so. I'm assuming we can probably afford to drop the holy waters, which we never used at all. Despite a lot of bleed coming in. Something hastily left behind by our ancestor. Oh, that's the sound of a task well performed. Ancestor's mustache cream. <laughs> um, again, don't really need food. I really need shovels. Oh my lord! Plus, we got this trophy. I don't even know what it does. Plus 20%. I mean, assuming it's a trinket. 20% damage extra against mark. 10 accuracy against mark. 5 crit against uh, size 2. We collected 12,000 gold. Probably not quite as much as we spent. Look at these. Look at these. Look at these. Lethargic. We, that's got to be cured. That's got to be cured. That's all right. Dude, that was huge. Big mission. Yo! They arrive with the east wind. The adder's kiss. Okay. Be smart. Probably want to start spending some relics, but... For now, we know that we need some stress treatment. Even though after two weeks, they'll be treated anyway. Um, first off, Robert... Spotted fever doesn't bother me that much. That much uh, being lethargic does. No excuse for that in today's economy, buddy. Um, lovely Momo. What did you get? Hemophilia. Could be worse. I thought we had another... Didn't we have another disease come out on that mission? Apparently not. Um, Wolf is going to need stress relief. A little, little pricey, but you know what? You get what you pay for in today's modern world. Nick is going to need some stress relief. I think that's it. We can let Fox Mulder simmer for a bit. So that was a great mission. Very thankful for what we got going on here for now. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. It helps a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. For now, thanks for watching. I will see you next time. See ya!